Winter Encounters House and hollow, village and valley side, the ceaseless pairings, the interchange in which the properties are constant. Resume its winter starkness, the hedges' barbs are bared, lengthened shadows intersecting, the fields seem parcelled smaller, as if by hedgerow within hedgerow, meshed into neighbourhood by such shifting ties. The house reposes squarely upon its acre, yet with softened angles the responsive stone changeful beneath the changing light. There is a riding forth, a voyage impending in this ruffled air, where all moves towards encounter, inanimate or human. The distinction fails in these brisk exchanges, say merely that the roof greets the cloud, or by the wall, sheltering its knot of talkers. Encounter enacts itself in the conversation on customary subjects where the mind may lean at ease, weighing the prospect of another's presence. Rain, and the probability of rain, tears and their progress through a field of wheat, these through of moment in themselves, serve rather to articulate the sense, that having met, one meets with more than the words can witness. One feels behind into the intensity that bodies through them, calmness within the wind, the warmth in cold.